Welcome back to the channel guys, it is me, AD744, so today guys, we're doing my conference league draw preview guys. So, um, remember guys, like and subscribe. So let's start with the pod one, let's start with Eintracht Frankfurt. Nah, I mean, I know they're a good cup kind of team, I just don't really know if it's like, they're going to go far in the conference league, obviously, but I don't know if they're going to win it. Dinamo Zagreb, eh, no. No, I'm sorry. They're not going to win it. After what I've seen in the qualifiers, no, nah, I'm not convinced. Club Bruges is a team to look out for. They could do very well. Um, do they have what it takes to win it? I don't think so. They can make it very far, though. AZ Alkamore is definitely a team you can't sleep upon. They're a very good team. Uh, we made They made it to the semifinals last season in the conference league, I believe. Ghent is also a very good shout. Farron Bache. Now, this is a team I would keep an eye upon. I think this is a team that could go very far. Lille is a good shout as well. Ferenc Varos. Nah, I'm not feeling with Ferenc Varos. Pauk is a decent shout. Slowly about to play. There's a good pick. Um, they could go far. They don't have enough to win it, though. Pauk, no. I, of the Pod 1 teams, I would probably say... Probably Frankfurt's probably the strongest. I'd probably agree with that. Yeah, I guess I'll say them my winners for now, but I'm not, like, 100% sold. Makiba Tel Aviv. Eh, definitely a good shout. They could do very far. Oh, actually, no. What am I saying? Aston Villa is my favorite. Aston Villa is the team I'm picking. Victoria Pleasant. Mm, eh, they're going to make it far, but they're not going to win it. Aston Villa is definitely my pick. Una Emery is doing an incredible job with this Aston Villa team. I think they're going to win the Conference League. That's my early pick. Ludogorets. Okay, that's a good shout. They could do far. They can make it far. I have a friend that's uh, supporting Bulgarian clubs. Uh, Fiorentina, they could go far as well. Bodo Glimt. Yeah, Bodo Glimt. I, though I do think they have fallen off a bit. They have lost some of their key players, like Boniface has left, so Balkan has left. Um, so they have lost some integral players. I think they'll still make. They'll still do well though in the competition. Gank is a good shout. Zohar Lunisk is a good shout. Astana, Besiktas, eh, AJK, no. The J Warsaw, no. Sparta, Timavi, nope. Olympia, Lubana, nope. Zerniski, Monster, nah. KI. Now, KI is a team I would look out for. I'm, I'm really excited to see what KI can do. I'm going to definitely try to watch some of their games because, man, they've excited me a lot in the Champions League qualifiers. I mean, the fact that they're in the they're at, in European competition is an incredible story. Like, they're the first club from Furrow Island to ever do this. So, shout out to KI, man. Shout out to KI. Aberdeen is a good shout. They could do well. Kuk Kukraki is a good shout as well. Lugano. Barrow Bick. Shout out to them. Another team that came from the Champions League qualifiers from their very first round. So, they could do something. Norgelen and Balkani. Balkani, of course. So, I think the teams to look out for is definitely... Um, it's going to be interesting, guys. I'm really excited to see KI do well. I think they could do well. Barrow Bick as well. It's a good shout from Pot 4. Pot 3. I would say your best shout for underdog is probably Gank. Possibly Besiktas is my second pick. And then Pot 2. I'm looking at um, Sylvia and Batsisplay and Pock. And then from Pot 1, man. It's looking really strong, so... Yeah, um, yeah, like I said, guys, we'll have the draw reaction tomorrow at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to discuss about the Conference League group. So if you guys did enjoy, remember guys to like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys later, man. Peace out.